Boys, you already know this. If, if, if you're a TMF OG, your style IQ is through the roof, meaning that you understand that the clothing you wear can send whatever message you want. Whether you want to be an attractive guy, a professional, an artistic stylish guy, you can send that message. And today, we're going to do just that. Today, I'm going to help you send the message of that cool, bad boy style, even if you're not. I'm going to show you the tricks, the hacks, and the things that you could be doing, wearing, and even the grooming side that is going to make you look like that cool guy, the popular kid, the guy that, well, has everything going for him and looks like he's not even trying. All using style. If that sounds interesting, let's hop into it. Number one and probably the most important accessory out there are a pair of sunglasses. Now, you got to understand that every frame style, it tells a different story. If you got round frames, it's more of an artistic vibe. If you got, for example, club masters, it's more of a professional feel to it. More, more proper, you know? But if you got aviators, you're that cool stylish dude. You're that bad boy. And the beauty with aviators is that they came out in the 1930s for actually pilots. That's why they're called aviators when they were flying. Now they were taken by the common guy to be used as a nonchalant accessory that makes every dude look like a bad boy. Personally today, there's this certain je ne sais quoi. Every time I see a dude with aviator, it's this certain vibe of just a dude that just doesn't get hung up on his feelings, that doesn't care about the regular bullcrap that the rest of society cares about. Boys, if you do not have a pair of aviators yet, you need to pick up a pair. And right now, well, honestly, it's your lucky day because if you click the link down below, in J Black, the only models that they have available right now are the Aviators. They only got two. Everything else is sold out. If you guys have never heard of J Black, I've talked to you guys about my brand before. This brand is filled with quality. The whole point of J Black is giving you high end accessories at a low price. All the stuff is using polarized lenses, glass lenses, on top of that high quality stainless steel metal. And even, even though we're sold out, but our acetate is made in Italy, handmade in Italy, and you're buying these frames for under 50 bucks. If you were to get a, a pair of frames this quality anywhere else, you're gonna be paying three, four, or even 500 bucks for it. That's why if you want a pair of aviators, right now is the time to do so because everything else is sold out except those two models, and chances are they're about to go right now. If you guys don't hurry up, click the link down below and check them out. Number two, Wear an oud fragrance. You're probably sitting there thinking, what the hell is a oud fragrance, Jose? Does, does, does my Chanel Blue have it? Ha, huh. hell no, it's not in that fragrance. You see, oud is one of the most expensive perfume and greenness out there, and it's one of the most coveted ones because it's so intoxicating. It's just a powerful, musky scent that's super de desirable, and it derives from the wood from Southeast Asia. It's a tree, an agar tree that they call it. When you spray this on your body, the dark and strong undertones that th this scent has give you a boost of bad boy confidence, unlike any other basic fruity or fresh fragrance that the nice guys are wearing. Number three, have shiny hair. For some reason, cool ass dudes, dudes that are bad boys, always have shiny, slicked hair. It's never matte, it's never messy. Take g Easy for example. I like this guy because he really does have that bad boy aesthetic, even though everything else about his frame doesn't tell you otherwise. He's a tall, lanky, skinny dude that if he didn't wear the right clothing, he wouldn't look like a bad boy like he does now. And one of his signature features is his shiny hair. And he's a great example. Look at him when his hair is not shiny versus when it is shiny. You could do that at home too. All you need is some sort of pomade. Pomades are made to give you a high shine and luster to your hairstyle. So you're gonna wanna get rid of the paste or the clays or not use it for this specific look and instead switch over to a pomade that's gonna give you a shiny hairstyle that's to make you look slick and cool. Number four, I think you see this coming already, but it's a no brainer. You need to wear a leather jacket. Leather jackets, it's just like the top tier when it comes to looking like a bad boy. Again, g -Eazy is a great example of this. That it doesn't matter how skinny you are, when you wear a leather jacket, if it fits right, you're just gonna look like a bad boy, like a cool dude that, you know, he doesn't get flustered with styles and trends. Number five, boots. I'm trying to tell you the truth here. When you wear boots, you just look cooler. Boots, in general, like the leather jacket, 
adds to the aesthetic of ruggedness, adds to that work wear aesthetic of a dude that puts in the work, a dude that doesn't get flustered with styles and trends like the regular sneakerheads do. That's what makes you look cool. That's what makes you look nonchalant. Finally, number six, stick to dark color. You want to avoid your styles and your trends out of any joy, meaning get rid of all the bright colors. If you're looking for that cool or bad boy aesthetic, even if you're not a cool guy or you're just a super nice guy, you can give the appearance of being that cool guy by having a more simple monochromatic wardrobe. This doesn't mean be boring. You can wear multiple shades of gray, black, navy and white that gives you really awesome outfits that are still complex, still stylish, but since you voided it of any color, it makes you look cool. For some reason, it makes you look slick. Just to give you a quick example, go to Google right now or even on Pinterest and type in bad boy style and just look at the color palette that automatically pops up. Almost every outfit inspiration that comes into your feed is going to be a monochromatic dark color because this is the easiest way to look like a bad boy. And that's basically it for this week's video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also boys, don't forget, like I said, everything is sold out in Jade Black except aviators, which is good news for you because if you're trying to look like a bad boy, I'd click the link down below before they go as well. That's it for me today. See you next time.